Stephen, welcome to Carlisle United. Must be an exciting challenge for the next phase of your career. Very exciting. You know, I think um, when you look back on my managerial career thus far, my first two jobs were um, stabilising football clubs financially, developing young players and bringing a, a sustainable club moving forward. Then my next two jobs were survival jobs, going in at Fleetwood second bottom and retaining a League One status, and then at Paphos this time last year, which was slightly warmer, I must say. Uh, but again, staving off the threats of relegation. And, uh, and obviously coming here in a situation where we uh, currently sit um, in the playoff places is a very exciting opportunity. You know, great credit has to go to John and his staff, Paul and Tommy, and also the players who have uh, have got the club into this situation. And um, you know, my aims and ambitions coming here is to is to certainly try to achieve um, promotion this year. Nail on the head there, because usually you'll take a job, and it's because things are going wrong. How different is it to come into a club with this type of atmosphere? Well, it's much better because uh, fighting off relegation is very difficult. There's a lot of pressures go with it. It's not only, uh, you know, the disappointment of relegation. At many clubs, it can be uh, affect people's livelihoods in terms of uh, dropping finances, uh, unemployment, all of these types of aspects. So all of that pressure is a burden on the manager. It's a huge pressure to, to, to take. So obviously coming here, where you have the opportunity to uh, to continue, as I've said, the success and hopefully gain um, gain promotion. Because you know, sometimes in the modern game, with all the money involved, we actually forget what the game of football is about, and it's about winning. It's about winning and having medals to show for your efforts at the end of your your time. So I, I think that that's vital, and I think that that's one of the really exciting aspects about this job. I suppose the pressure here is the pressure of expectation because we're in the playoff places and we've got to maintain that, I suppose. Of course, but every job comes with its own uh, pressures. I would rather the pressures of expectation rather than what I have uh, endured in the past. But uh, really exciting. You know, I was at the game at the weekend, obviously a disappointing result. But, you know, I've seen the quality. I've seen why the club is sitting in its current position. Um, and hopefully over the next week or so we can add to that in terms of the personnel. You know, there's several players have returned to their their uh, their clubs due to the loan deals expiring so you know there are reinforcements required but certainly we have the nucleus a very strong team here and uh, and I can't wait to get my teeth into it. That's the other pressure the fact that we've got two weeks of a very important transfer window to go with the squad looking a little bit light there's work to do there. There is definitely work to do you know and we'll be working 24-7 to ensure that we get the right players in. Um, I'll speak to the, the current staff about that, about their feelings on the squad. I have my own ideas, but it's very important they work on a daily basis with them, so their input's vital to this. So, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll uh, certainly be speaking to them today and tomorrow about that, and uh, and hopefully we can make sure that we get the right players in to complement the ones that are here at this moment in time. Staff-wise, I suppose that confirms that you are happy to work, keep the continuity with Tommy and Paul. Absolutely. You know, I know Tommy. Um, you know, me and Tommy have uh, crossed paths a number of times. You know, he's a terrific coach, a terrific person, and he's, he's obviously a Scotsman like myself. Paul worked previously at Fleetwood, and uh, I wasn't there during his reign there, but uh, I spoke to a number of people that have worked with him and speak very highly of him. So I'm looking forward to that, you know. And the great thing when I'm working with new people is that they can bring new ideas as well that I haven't previously thought about. So, you know, it, it's a good period. I'm really looking forward to it, and... Uh, you know, excited, as I've said, by the challenge. That experience they've got of this squad through the first half of the season, that must make the transition for you a little bit easier? Yeah, it's, it's, it's different for me coming into this club, as I've said. You know, it's not a, a situation where it's broken. So it's not about me coming in and making wholesale changes, as I've had to do in other clubs to, to turn things around. This is me coming in and, of course, giving time and... Uh, you know, uh, working with the players, I will obviously make 
changes in time, but not at this moment. There's not significant changes required, one or two tweaks, but uh, again, I will speak to Tommy and Paul about that.